Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Claudia and I'm here with another video. Today I am going to be sharing with you guys uh, what I've been doing. As you guys know, I have over 250 perfumes and it's really hard for me. A lot of the times I think it's the most complicated part of starting my day. It's when I begin to really kind of decide which perfume I'm gonna be wearing or which combination of perfume I'm gonna be wearing and having so many perfumes you would think that would be no problem but it gets harder because you have such a wide selection that you get literally just bombarded with ideas as to what you should wear and since you can only wear that perfume or that combo one time or two a day you have to really kind of be selective so it's kind of hard so i came up with something with an idea and i decided to make a weekly tray so that way it'll save me time it'll sa save me all the anguish that i have to go through thinking about oh my god i want to wear what do i wanna, what am i gonna wear what should i wear and stuff like that it saves a lot of that so i decided to come up with this and i want to show you what i did put together so today is friday right today is friday the 30th of um september so i'm gonna start on october 1st <coughs> i'm sorry and I'm gonna start in October 1st what I chose to wear tomorrow, beginning tomorrow. And so it's gonna be just seven days. So we're gonna start with what I chose. I chose um, to wear this um, uh, uh, Banana Republic Dark Cherry and Amber. Such a beautiful fragrance. The only problem with this fragrance, in my opinion, is that it leans very masculine. So I came up with an another fragrance to layer it with to give it that feminine edge and just kind of sweeten it up even more because this fragrance is already sweet it's got a lot of um cherry in it it's got it's just a beautiful fragrance but it does need a little bit of a feminine edge for me uh, and i decided to go with uh, vanilla 28 kali and so i layered them together and they actually work very very nice together I'd have to say that Kayali takes over for a little bit and it kind of doesn't get along with it as much as I would like, but you let it go for about five minutes and they begin to get along perfectly on my skin. They blend together so, so good. And so I've been trying this combination and I like it. And uh, my Kayali vanilla is already turning color because of the vanilla. So that's gonna be for Monday. Uh, I mean for Saturday and so we're gonna do on Sunday we're gonna start with Serge of Overture which is a beautiful beautiful fragrance that I just absolutely adore and this fragrance could be worn during the day I wear it during the day I love it it's super super elegant and so what I do is that when I'm going to go and refresh and put something else for later in the evening I chose uh, Tony Iommi, which is a very boozy fragrance, a very uh, unisex fragrance. Um, it's very uh, gourmand fragrance. I love it. Um, I'm going to be wearing this one and that's going to be on Sunday. And then on Monday, I am going to be wearing uh, uh, by also Serge of Casamorati, Lira. Lira uh, or Lira is going to be, oh, so gourmand it's so it reminds me so much this starbucks uh almond croissant is just so delicious it smells like a pastry and so just to start my week you know i i will be wearing this one and i usually spray it more than once because this one tends to kind of sit closer to the skin so i spray it twice during the day and so on Tuesday, we're moving on. I'm going to wear another combination that I came up with. This is going to be uh, Musk Noir by Nerissa Rodriguez. That is going to be um, another combo with uh, Dama Bianca. Dama Bianca and Narcissa Rodriguez get along so well. They are two very different uh, fragrances, but honestly, once you blend them, you realize that they actually get along really well. This one, not letting Dama Bianca disappear in the back. And it just kind of just, it seems to me like on my skin, it just really kind of gives it a boost. So it's a really good combo. 
and that's gonna be for Tuesday. And so I decided to get, um, to, so that's gonna be Tuesday. And Wednesday, I am going to be wearing Bouquet Ideal by uh, Casamaretti Collection from Surge Up as well. And I combine it with a replica coffee break. And it also gives it this um, coffee house sort of a feel because this one uh, has that gourmand cinnamon sort of smell. And then you introduce the coffee break, which gives it this uh, creamy, um, almost like um, uh, almost like a creamer sort of coffee with a creamer, like a latte sort of thing. And I love doing that one. And so we're gonna move on with Thursday. Thursday is probably gonna be my favorite because I will be wearing uh, Burberry Her Elixir. Uh, Burberry Her Elixir, oh my God, I'm gonna be about it, you guys. This fragrance is absolutely divine. This fragrance is just to die for. My favorite fragrance that I own that is, of course, a designer fragrance. My favorite designer fragrance would have to be this one, hands down, absolutely. Um, that's gonna be on Thursday. And on Friday, I'm gonna do another uh, layering combo with a replica uh, coffee break and Angelic Noir from Guerlain. Um, it's going to be a really good one because uh, Angelic Noir has this kind of a green edge to it. It is very, very spicy. It has the beautiful vanilla in the bag, but it's more of a, of a darker uh, fragrance. And when you layer it with this one, you get oh, this beautiful combination. It's, it's absolutely delicious. These two are absolutely wonderful. And it's something that is going to be good because now it's getting a little bit cooler. I'm able to wear this. And I am super, super excited. I, I was so excited about summer. I am so excited about fall and winter. I can't believe that I'm going to be wearing my favorite perfumes. And that's gonna be it, you guys, for today. I hope that you liked the video. What do you think about me doing that? It's the only way that I can, that I can really give all my perfumes a chance to be worn. Because if I just go the way I've been doing it, it doesn't really keep all my other perfumes an opportunity to kind of be worn and that way if if i do this and i make sure that i i rotate them and make sure that they're used i feel like it's a good thing uh, and i don't have to really go through it every day so that way i just do a one time deal where i choose where i'm going to be wearing which is a lot easier for me um, as opposed to just doing it every day and having to just walk around my bedroom looking at all my fragrances 20 times until I decide. It's just such a pain in the butt to do that. But I hope that you guys like this video. If you have any comments or any suggestions on other perfumes, if you guys haven't, um, I have a perfume in mind that you guys want me to review, please leave it on the comments. I'll try to do my best to at least uh, go ahead and give it a smell. And, uh, and I hope that you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. And if you're a subscriber, I want to say thank you so much. I appreciate you. And I'll see you back on the next video. Have a great day. Bye-bye.